Okay, so I'm back at Crumble. I have the, I bought the oatmeal cookie and then the caramel pumpkin one. Now it is too early to be doing pumpkin spice, but they're doing it anyway. I'm gonna cut these cookies in half so I don't end up at Jackson Mortuary or in diabetic shock. So let's see how this caramel pumpkin one is. 10 the best thing ever. Nine, I go out of my way to get it. Seven, seven and a half. I consider buying it again. Five, barely edible. And zero, just the worst thing ever. So. It's not bad. I'll give it an eight. You'll give it an eight. Mm. I'll give it an eight. It's not bad. No. This classic oatmeal is really what I'm looking forward to. It says it's just like the basic oatmeal. Let me clear my knife off. It was a little gooey in the middle. A little too gooey for me. Let me see how this classic oatmeal is. I'll say nine and a half. It's a really good take on a basic cookie. I mean, it's standard, has good flavor. It's soft where it needs to be, nice, a little hard out of crust. Is that Miss Thomas? Go, go, because I'm going to say something. <laughs> you, better, you better get the fuck off camera because I'm going to say something. <laughs> 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 okay, so yeah, um, I forgot the video I was recording. Okay, it's a solid 10. Um, nine and a half. Talk to you later. Goodbye. Okay, so excuse that earlier. I don't know what my sister said, but the oatmeal was a nine and a half out of 10. It wasn't the best thing ever, but it was a delicious cookie. I would definitely order it again with no problem. The caramel apple, it was good. But once again, just a little too sweet. I would just take the icing off of it and it would be good. So yeah, I'm looking forward to next week.